Good morning, my revolutionary people. Today is day 53 of running from my family of serial killers, the Kudarafs. Day 53. Not quite sure what town I am in. I'm outside of Albuquerque, near an Indian reservation. Yesterday was crazy. The last couple days were crazy. The realization that so here's what happens. I took the Tony Robbins seminar, right? And it gave me more answers. He thought he'd be like, he's, he's good. I definitely give him that, he's good, but way better than my mom. And they both use um, the neuro-linguistic programming that was used in the 70s. My mom learned it in the military. And I think Tony Robbins learned it from the guy who actually invented it in California, who was a murderer. But the murderer got himself off because he used neuro-linguistic programming during his trial. At least that's what I read. So that was pretty interesting. So that's what they don't want me to talk about. They used NLP on me when I was younger. And I'm pretty sure they used it on, I think everyone just uses it. That's what it is, because a lot of people in the real estate industry use it, but they use it poorly. They're not very good. I think that's who they teach the NLP to, is the realtors. Like, the family, the families, or the cult, that's like a group of families that controls everything. That's pretty interesting, right? So there's a group of families that control everything. My family's a big part of it. I don't understand why, though, because... I still don't understand why. It has something to do with... Maybe they're... I don't know. See, I, I just... It's hard for me to see them as anything more than just, like, dysfunctional. And they're not very fancy. I just... I don't see them as successful, so it's hard to see them as having power. But they do, so it's really interesting. So yeah, NLP, autism, narcissism, and my family cult is all tied together. You know how narcissists can feel people? Like they instantly know people? I believe that's because they have autism. Because I was like, <laughs> I was genetically modified and created to be great evil. And I can see everything in people. And it's not pleasant because I don't use it to my best advantage because that's wrong, right? I like to read people, it's like reading books, but, and I learn a lot from it, but it doesn't, that's why narcissists are good at what they do, and they're good at manipulation, because they, and I will admit, like, I've definitely used some of the stuff that I have seen for not great, but I don't think I really ever did anything really wrong with it because it makes you feel, it makes me feel bad. And yesterday I said thank you to the guy who told me about Asperger's and Sierra Vista when I was there. And that made me feel a little guilty too. But I have to admit, it got me the desired result. And that's something that you all do all the time. Go roll other people under the bus and just call it survival. So that was an interesting thought as well. I don't know. There's been so much stuff the past couple days and my brain is pretty pieced up because of all the poison. <laughs> They've been poisoning me really bad. Yesterday I definitely hit a big thing. So Tony Robbins lives in Florida but he was born in California and California is where Mike Snow lives and they are related you can tell just by looking at them. And yeah that really got some people going so that was interesting and i know i know better than to get caught up in my feelings and yet i still do it i got overwhelmed big time big time big time it just keeps getting bigger every day every day it's nuts i'm not quite sure how to take it all in but I'm trying to process as quickly as possible and figure out what I want to do next because you all are good people and you deserve to hear it. And the fact that, that you're only using a small part of your brain 
it's not fair. Like, if they just leave you alone so that you can calm down and soothe your nervous system, then you would be so much happier. Even if you just got to relax a little bit. Like, that's what life is all about. It's just, just relax. Calm down. Center yourself. Enjoy the moment. Life is all about the moment. You just got to get centered and grounded in the moment. And then you will... you'll be able to see there's so much beauty in the world the world is so beautiful and it's a blessing life is beautiful even in all this mess i still see that life is beautiful other people just don't i guess they don't have access to that beauty which is sad because it surrounds us all the time every day <laughs> So I am intrigued. What have you all been up to lately? How's the neuro-linguistic programming go? going? Because all you have to do is tell yourself you're a good person. Just say you are a good person every day for like 30 to 60 days. So I guess I'll just tell you, you are a good person. You are worthy of love and greatness. Your birthright is being amazing. You have greatness inside of you. Your life is meant to be lived to whatever extreme you want it to be. You can do anything you want to do. You are meant for greatness and you deserve anything you are willing to work towards. I love you all. I don't have much to say today. Have a great day.